Welcome everybody, this is your boy Dryden Mataro and we're here with another Grand Theft Auto V PC modding tutorials. Like always, if you like this video, smash that like button and if you're new here, subscribe for more daily gaming content and we're going to get straight into the video. Welcome back guys, this video is all about on how to install your Subaru STI 7 inside your Grand Theft Auto V folder. So like always, this is the add-on method, so we are going to install this with the add-on method. So like always guys, make sure you download all of the requirements that's inside my description below. And make sure that the requirements is the latest version. And once you guys have completed that, then download this mod i will leave this mod inside my description below so you guys can download it i have already downloaded the mod so i don't need to download it once you guys have completed the process all you guys gotta do is go to your grand theft auto v game hover over it right click and open file location make sure you guys do install all the requirements as well because you guys will need it now head over to your mods folder go to your update folder go to time 64 folder and then go inside your drc packs folder now head to your subaru extract folder and now open up the folder guys now inside that folder there is another folder so open up that folder and now we have got um, a few things in here. So we are going to do the add-on method. So all you guys got to do is click on add-on. And then click on Subaru STI 7 folder. And drag it inside your DRC packs. And now go back to your extract folder. And then go back to your main files. Then go to your readme.txt. Now in here is um, a code. Copy the DRC packs code over here. And then now just copy it guys, okay. Exit out of your text file. Exit out of your extract folder. And open up your open IV. Go to your search box and search for note pad. And just paste your code right there for now because you will need that for oh, for your open iv now go to your grand theft auto v windows wait for a few seconds it all depends on your pc performance once your application is open go to edit mode select yes then go to your mods folder go to update go to update.rpf then go to common go to data and then all you guys got to do is scroll right down the bottom until you see drclist.xml, which is over here. Hover over the file, right click and click on edit. Scroll right down the bottom. Now, as you guys can see that the code looks different, okay? So the code looks different um, as you guys can see. So what we are going to do, we're going to copy the code that is in there already okay just copy the code that is in there already okay and then just copy okay copy then now click on item over there press enter once and then paste the code back in there again now all you guys got to do is copy the code inside your extract folder copy the Subaru code and now just minimize that now go back in here and just click over here and now delete all this okay and the drc packs and then just paste it right there and that's all you guys got to do and then save it go back to your drc list.xml double click and check to see if it's there and yes it is Exit out of your application, go back to your edit mode, go back to GTA V, then exit out of your open IV, 
go back to your Grand Theft Auto V main folder, right click, refresh your folder, exit out of your Grand Theft Auto V game folder, right click, refresh your desktop, and I'll see you guys in the game. And welcome back, we're here with Franklin. So what we're going to do is that we are going to spawn the vehicle, and we're going to show you guys how to spawn the vehicle. And after that, we will show you guys a little video about the vehicle, okay guys? So, to spawn the vehicle, there is different ways, okay? You can use menu or you can use trainer V. But I always use my trainer, so that's the, uh, that's the menu that I always spawn my vehicle. So, to spawn your vehicle with trainer is press F4 and then go down to your vehicle spawning and then go down to edit vehicle menus and then find the Subaru STI right here and there goes the, the Subaru guys it looks pretty cool uh, but um, I'm going to show you guys this car modded okay uh, because right now it's just only standard um, yeah right now it's just standard okay guys so uh, I'm going I'm going to modify it and then I'll show you guys the video okay after this but that's all we have for now guys okay so I hope you guys do enjoy it if you guys did then let me know in the comments if you guys still get stuck on how to install this mod then please let me know in the comments if I don't comment back fast enough for you then just contact me inside my discord server and then I'll be more than welcome to uh, reply back to you guys okay so with that all said guys i hope you guys do enjoy this video if you guys did then smash that like button and subscribe for more daily gaming content and i'll see you guys on my next video don't forget to stay tuned for this video